I want to share with you the story of Catherine Mary Lane. It's not somebody that you will have heard of. She's known to me as Great Aunt Jane. She's my husband's great aunt. She was born in 1908 and lived a quiet and unobtrusive life. She inspired me because of the way she lived her life and the choices that she made. I didn't meet her till she was in her 80s and she looked just like Miss Marple ought to look a little old lady with white hair in a bun. And it would be so easy to have overlooked her or dismissed her as somebody who was worth little in her old age. In her midlife, she had as a single woman who was living with her brother and looking after his home in the mid-century, taken on responsibility for her two nephews when her brother and his wife died. She took on responsibility for these two teenagers and through them for their extended families. And she did that with extraordinary grace and love and compassion. That in itself would have been remarkable enough that she put aside whatever choices she may have had for herself in order to be available for the family that needed her. As a young woman, she had challenged the unjust status quo and chosen to work in a home for single mothers. She felt that it was wrong that these young women who were often pregnant as a result of abuse and manipulation were ostracised and excluded by society. And by her loving care to show them that they too were precious and valuable and worth something. And her inspiration to me is to remember always that faith must be shown by love in practical action and that we shouldn't judge people by what they appear to be on the inside, but recognise them for what God sees and loves. Thank you.